Roman Catholic Archbishop Jason Gordon is calling on citizens of Trinidad and Tobago to be good neighbors to their fellow men coming in from Venezuela. The Archbishop during his Ask the Archbishop live Facebook chat on Wednesday pointed to Trinidad and Tobago's generosity to the country and people of Dominica after Hurricane Maria. He said, as a people, we really need to dig deep and find ways to reach out and help the people of Venezuela who are in serious need. The Archbishop said he understands the economic challenges this country faces and the fears that Trinbagonians feel. Coming to take over our social security, they come in. I understand that, but that's not quite true. Let's think about it in another way. They're also coming to make a contribution to us. Last month, the government received backlash from international human rights agencies and opposition politicians in Venezuela after it repatriated 82 Venezuelans who had been in detention in Trinidad. Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley also received some criticism for saying Trinidad and Tobago was not a refugee camp. The Archbishop said, though, it's not the first time Venezuelans have flocked to Trinidad as he recalled the origin of the word coco pile. They were called then from Venezuela to Trinidad and Tobago. By, by 1870, there was an economic boom in cocoa, and that's because a lot of the Venezuelans came in and worked in the, in the cocoa estates and, and were the backbone of the whole cocoa industry. Payol comes from the Venezuelans working in cocoa and, and really building that industry in Trinidad and Tobago.